pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. another edition of Swamp Talk. I'm Ainsley. And I'm Emily. Today is Tuesday, December 20th, and we have a few very important announcements for you. The holiday dress-up days for the week of December 19th are Monday, holiday socks, Tuesday, class colors, freshmen are red, sophomores are white, juniors are blue, and seniors are green. Wednesday is holiday hats, and Thursday is holiday sweaters. Come out and support your Gators basketball teams tonight. The boys have a game versus Mitchell at 6 o'clock here, and the girls basketball game at, at Mitchell at 6 o'clock. There's a girls weightlifting county championship at River Ridge High School tomorrow, December 21st. A cheerleading meet versus Wesley Chapel High at 6 p.m., and a girls varsity soccer game versus Zephyr Hills at 6.30. There is a boys basketball game Thursday, December 22nd at 6 o'clock at Anclote. There is also a varsity girls basketball game at 5 a at 6.30. Go Gators! There is a winter band concert at, from 7 p.m. at Wesley Chapel Performing Arts Center. Now here's a look at how some Land O'Lakes students have been spending their days leading into the holidays. My students at Land O'Lakes have been working hard during this time of the year to prepare their projects for Pasco and State Fair. We managed to interview and get some footage of these hardworking students and got a glimpse of what it is like to be in the program. Hi, I'm Emily. I'm Jilly. And I'm Bruna. These are our goods, Fancy, Daisy, and Chanel. And over winter break, we plan on getting them ready for show. By getting them ready for show, we practice showmanship. Sean Thomas, a freshman student with the Swine Project, is spending time cleaning and caring for his pig Tucker. Over break, he will practice showmanship with his pig and feed to make sure he meets the weight requirement. One student, however, has been preparing for more than show this holiday season. Corbin Elkin, a member of the Land Lakes High School FFA officer team, has been preparing for his goat Rose to give birth. A week and a half ago, his early Christmas presents came, and Land Lakes FFA welcomed two new members to the family. We want to wish all of the FFA students success at the upcoming fair, and we cannot wait to see what they accomplish in the near future. That's all for today, Gators. Tune in next time for another edition of Swamp Talk.